Hey guys, welcome to my channel. This is Alyssa and yeah, I've been away for a few weeks but I'm here now and today I have for you a comparison between a very special deck and one of my favorite RWS decks. So yeah, this is uh, a deck that the Hermit Cave featured a few weeks ago and this is the Roses and Lilies by Conrad Stein <coughs> and it's available on Make Playing Cards. Uh, sorry for my voice, I've been sick for the past two weeks but I'm getting better now so yeah. So back to the topic, this deck, what it is basically is uh, scans of the original Roses and Lilies from the 1909 and Conrad had uh, approval from the owner of this deck, the original copy, Saskia. Uh, and he had an approval to put it in MPC and reproduce it so that um, more of us can enjoy the original deck. Now, the <clears throat> Centennial here, this is the Centennial uh, with Borders from US Games. Uh, this deck is basically based on this one and that's why I thought that it would be a great comparison to see yeah, if it's really truly based on the original. This is the first ever RWS um, produced mass market in 1909. So uh, this is going to be a silent flip through and you can see for yourself the differences in the cards or the similarities. So let's begin with the full. I only received this uh, yesterday and I really love it. And this is only for collectors purposes only for me. <coughs> I will continue using my Centennial. But uh, it's amazing that we have the opportunity to hold the original deck in our hands. <coughs> so you can see now here the Hermit, the uh, filter that they applied over the Centennial is really visible uh, in the blues. Like it's more on the greenish side on the Centennial. But both decks are beautiful and I really enjoy the Centennial so I'll continue using it. The lines are crisper because they touched it up a bit. But yeah, I cannot express how excited I am to hold this deck in my hands. It's literally part of tarot history.
and this deck is also really affordable uh, if you're interested the link will be down in the description box below And I forgot to mention, but this has no copyright on the front, which is a big plus. And the last card, the King of Wands. I hope you enjoyed this uh, flip through and comparison between the two decks. Overall, they're very similar. They're actually similar. And uh, having a closer look, you can really see that they didn't change much from, these, uh, from the original deck when they did the Centennial. They just put a filter. Uh, made the, the black a little bit darker and yeah that's most of the things that they did they fixed a bit the colors but uh, it's really visible in some cards there were some spots that were identical in both decks so yeah the bags i adore the roses and lilies bags and on my <clears throat> deck that I, I did a recoloring of the RWS and the bags I used this bag but in a darker bluish tone for the uh, for that deck and I'll be showing it in the next video. Thank you for watching and if you like the video please consider liking it, subscribing to my channel and <clears throat> all that good stuff. Thank you and see you next time.